Hello, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add background music in video on Canva. The first thing you will need to do is sign into your account on canva.com. Once you have done that, you are going to select the template or design that you would like to use. For example, if I were to select video right here, it redirect me to this dashboard. And you can see that I already have a video on my timeline. To add the video, you'll simply go over to uploads. From there, you can select images or videos and you can simply add the video. After you have added the video, you can add your first audio track. You can go over to uploads once more and from there you could tap on upload files and you could add the audio that you want. For example, if I were to tap on audio right now, you can see different audio tracks right here. And by the way, majority of these audio tracks are voiceovers that I recorded using Canva. I'll be showing you how to do that later on in the tutorial. But first, to add a voiceover or an audio track, you can simply drag and place it onto the timeline. And you also want to ensure that this cursor is right where you would like to add the audio track. After you have done that, if the audio track is a bit longer than the video, all you will need to do, you could tap right where you see Beat Sync. You could tap on that. And from there, you could simply toggle it on or you could tap on the three dots right here and from there you could tap on adjust and if you would like to remove the last part right here you can simply drag it and from there you could delete it if you want as you can see right there once you have done that it is time to add the second track or the background music and again you are going to move the cursor to where you would like to place the music so i want it to be at the front part of the video so once I've done that, you're going to go over to audio once more, tap on the audio that you'd like to use, then you're going to drag and place the music right there. After you have done that, since this is background music, you want it not to be as loud as the voiceover. So I'm going to tap on the voiceover track, then tap on the three dots. From there, you're going to select volume and you can increase the volume if you want. After you have increased the volume, you are going to tap on the background music track now. So you can see it right here. Once you have done that, again, you are going to tap on the three dots or you can simply right click, tap on volume. So let me reload it. Something is wrong right there. But normally once you tap on the three dots, you will see the option to decrease the volume. So let me do that again once the page has been refreshed. Let's do that real quick. Again, let me tap on this track right here. Then tap on the three dots. Then you're going to tap on volume. And you're going to decrease the volume. Since this is the background music. Then after you have done that, you can play it right now. And you will realize. And that's basically it. And you can decrease the volume even further if you want. Again, tap on the three dots, then tap on volume, and you can decrease it even further. Or if you would like to do any further adjustments, by tapping on the three dots, you could tap on audio effects, and you could add audio effects if you want. If you would like to edit it even further, you could tap on adjust, and from there you can cut out different sections. And if you were paying attention earlier and you want to know how to add the voiceover or how to record a voiceover using Canva, all you'll need to do is simply go onto the video track just like you'll see right here. Then you're going to go over to the top right hand corner, tap on share. Once you have tapped on share, right below copy link, you're going to see the option present and record. You can tap on that. If you don't see present and record right there, what I recommend you do is scroll down, tap on the three dots right where you see more. Then at the top, you are going to see present and record. Once you have tapped on that, you are going to select go to recording studio. After you have tapped on go to recording studio, you will be redirected to a new dashboard. And you are going to select no camera since we only want to record a voiceover. Then from there below it, you are going to see default microphone 
and if you are using an external microphone you can select it or if you would like to use the built-in microphone on your device you can select it also after you have selected the microphone that you would like to use you are going to tap on start recording and it will give you a countdown then from there you can simply tap on play and you can start recording your voiceover if you would like to pause it in between you could tap on pause then you can tap on resume and you can tap on done when you are finished and you can see on the right hand column right here you can see add notes so if you would like to add a video script to read meanwhile doing your voiceover you can do that I'm going to be showing you how to do that but once you are finished recording the voiceover you would simply tap on done and after you have tapped on done it is going to present you with a video link and you can copy the video link and share it with anyone and that person that you are sharing it with does not have to have a Canva account so they'll be able to view the video without being a Canva subscriber or so on or if you simply like to download it you could tap on download and then download it as an mp4 but if you like to use the audio in the future all you'll need to do is tap on save and exit once you have tapped on save and exit once you go over to the left hand menu option tap, tap on upload then tap on audio you are going to see the audio track right here as you can see recording and you could tap on the three dots and in the future you could download it if you want as you can see right there or if you'd like to delete it you can delete it and that's basically it and also if you would like to add the video script as I was saying earlier before starting to record all you'll need to do is tap on notes right here then from there you can paste in your video script and then you're going to do the same steps like earlier tap on share in the top right hand corner then you're going to tap on present and record and that's it I hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe and thank you for watching